Hey, you see this stupid title, but no in time when it's Friday, got a long. Ah, let me speak, man. Hmm. Characters that be getting tucked. We all know there's some wholesome, cute moments between couples and anime and cartoons, but I'm gonna present you the ones that truly broke my heart and how these guys deserved better. First cook we got is unsurprising on this list is Aaron Yeager. Bro huh? Look at how. So at the end of the manga, my boy Aaron got played so dirty. Mikasa, who's been sipping on Aaron the whole ass series, and yet she pulls this shit. <laughs> No, he did not. He did not see that. And now, I, I, I don't know why I thought he was. He was like, I don't know why I thought those captions were the actual captions from the actual enemy. I don't know why. Oh, she's getting fucked by Donkey Dick. You know, because he fucking died and shit, and then he got reincarnated, and then now he has to watch Mikasa getting fucked like that. That truly is a fate. Wait, 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 who got reincarnated? She's getting fucked by. Saitama! And now she's getting fucked by Donkey Dick. You know, because he fucking died and shit. And who died? Then he got reincarnated, and then now he has to watch Mikasa getting fucked like that. That truly is a fate worse than. Oh wait, Aaron died, then he got reincarnated as a horse. Yeah. And it's not even just Mikasa. Historia cucked him too when he couldn't even be the one to impregnate her. It's also a L to Reiner who chose to save the world over Kuchi. Bro, I ain't no Yuri shipper, but I would rather see Ymir and Historia together than to random ass farmer be clapping. I know Eren treated Mikasa like shit later in the series, but he's an exception because, well, one, Eren is Eren, okay? He's the edgelord. And second, let's take a look at his genetics, okay? Just look at him and his mom. They look great. And now let's take a look at Jean and his mom. Uh-huh, exactly. Both Mikasa and- <laughs> Are you hating that nigga? See, you hating that another nigga put in? Nah, nah, it's crazy that you... he mad that Aaron didn't put his wiener in her in 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 whatever this goofy this goofy girl is, man. I don't forgot her name, bro. Yeah, he wanted wait. He mad that another nigga put their wiener in her and not his uh Aaron Yeager his wiener, bro. I don't even know what to bro. He meant that another nigga didn't put a, the wiener in her instead of Aaron. And Aaron doesn't even know this nigga. Like, damn, bro, what type of zesty things are going on here? could have had that high spec. But nah, they got clapped by a horse and an average Joe. Next guy we got is Ichigo. This man, Ichigo, got cucked so bad, he risked his life to save Rukia from getting executed from the Soul Society. But she ends up getting fucked. By the dude with that disgusting hairline. Oh my god, bro. Oh, hell no, man. What the fuck, man? Get your ass on, bro. Renji, he's just so goddamn hideous. He looks like a combination of the Grinch in 6 9 This guy is such a walking hell. Like, look at this man, bro. You not like that, bro. Nah, you put in parts where he's like being beaten. Talking about, come on. You went live and said you pop niggas. You don't pop niggas. You went live and said you whoop niggas. <sighs> you don't whoop niggas. You went live and said niggas know how you get down. Nobody know how you get down. What the fuck is you talking about? Rukia! Why on God grief earth? Why on God grief fuck would you want to choose Renji? He's a bum since day one. I don't give a fuck about his win in the blood war. It's just two ugly asses fighting each other. Let's take a look at Rukia's daughter. 
You forget it, man. We don't know. Shit. The nigga probably got something for me. Pause. Some good D. You never know. She ended up inheriting that disgusting hairstyle. Bro, I blame Aizen for this. He's the one that sent that bitch Rukia in the first place. At first, I was like, damn, Aizen is a real one. He sent this baddie for me. Bro, he ain't no villain. And then you find out she's getting fucked by this monstrous creature known as Reggie. Then I'm like, no, nah, what the fuck? Out of all his crimes, that gotta be his worst crime yet. He catfished Ichigo with Rukia's pussy. He pussy fished him with Rukia. Rukia is actually a whore and a What are these clips, man? Dumb one at that. Didn't you used to be broke, living off the streets? And aren't you part of the Kuchiki clan, one of the top family members in the Soul Society? And you know what Ichigo is? <laughs> Sounds like the Kuchi clan. It's, he is a gold mine. He's privileged. He's part of everything. And he chose the fraud over the drip god? I'm impressed Byakuya approves of this. Bruh, oh, remove that man's meat out your mouth, okay, man. Because his ancestors are rolling in their graves right now. Ichigo literally had to go through the exact same arc with a different girl. Because the last one was a thigh. Ichigo is so down bad. When she's hurt, he's hurt. And as soon as he lost his soul reaper powers, rather than fucking Orihime, he was just thinking about that bitch Rukia. He really resorted to poetry for that hope. And is somehow his cure <sighs> for depression. Bro, Orihime is way better than Rukia. Oh, yeah, not I am. Annoying. <laughs> you. Wait, someone caring about you is annoying. I don't know, man. Shit. She look better. She got, you feel me? She got some big knockers on her arm, you feel me? She look better. The fuck is you talking about? Sliss. Okay, 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 okay. You got a point there, you got a point. But at least she's loyal. And she's got great tits, unlike Flatty over there. Rukia has to be mentally <laughs> insane to go with Renchi. I'm glad Ichigo got Orihime. That's great now. But great guys like Oryu and Chad get no bitches. But that piece of shit Renchi does? Nah, if Rukia's dumbass actually went for Ichigo, Oryu could have Orihime and Chad gets Tutsuki. Everybody wins. What about Reggie? What about Reggie? Who cares, man? Bro, he could have Mizuru. But sadly, this didn't happen. Rukia, did it ever occur to you that, hey, Ichigo deserves this pussy after everything he went through for me? Bro, didn't you say it's flat or whatever, something? Like, she ain't got no, she ain't got no good badges on her. Then why do you want Ichigo to get the... But nah, give it to the guy that had to beg him to do the job for him. I wouldn't be able to handle that. Maybe Ichigo is just a new kind of strong. Stronger than all of us. Couldn't be me, bro. It could not be me. If I knew that bitch was gonna fuck Renji even after I saved her from the Soul Society, I would have let that bitch die, okay? <laughs> bro, she don't fuck with you, nigga. Just move on, bro. Bro, he, he even got a better package. What the hell you call her? That one with the big knockers. That's her, she with the better tits. She's on her own. You're on your own, okay? <sighs> this is worse than the Naruto cut case. Because with Naruto, he dodged a bullet. Because the Sakura's jeans are so useless, her Uchiha daughter needs glasses. And the guy she cucked him for is one, not ugly, and two, on the same level as Naruto. Renji, he's not that guy, bro. Okay, you're not that guy. Trust me. You're, you're not, not that, that guy. guy. Okay. Thank like God damn, Bleach bro. doesn't have kiss scenes. I will not be able to stomach this monstrous couple Renji and Rukia making out. Renji is literally the ugly bastard. He's probably the type of- Bro, I'm the I'm man. Renji probably took this nigga bitch in real life, man. Guys I don't know, man. don't get his dick beaded. There are a lot of couples that disgust me, but not once was it based on appearance. Rukia was a beauty in her bunkai, and now she's like Fiona from Shrek. An ugly ass. I know people are gonna be all like, Rukia is just his friend. Yeah, your friend without benefits. Like, <laughs> I know Rukia is 150 years old, but given what Ichigo went through for her, you- A victim! He just admitted it. It's a victim situation. So yeah, at least, like, they didn't, they didn't do the, 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 the normal weird anime where, like, this is like an older person and a, and a, a, young, a kid dating. 
So at least like they did that. But I don't know how old that the the bitch with the teeth is. Uh, her age is. I think, but but I think they are the same age or something. Might as well hit as soon as you turn eighteen. But the bitch wants Renji. Like, bro, there are better options than just him. There's Toshiro, who's like the guy version of her. Shit, even that femboy is a better pick than Renji's <laughs> ugly ass. Me personally, I think Ichigo should just be fucking both. I would rather be Ichigo's whore than Renji. Nah, me personally, bro, if it was me, I'm not taking that, bro. I need meat on my bone, bro, like I keep saying. I need meat on my bone, bro. His wife. I would rather be in a threesome with Kenpachi and Mayuri than fuck with Renji. I would have slammed that fucking door when Rukia showed up 10 years later. I don't get why Ichigo doesn't get up and be like, you know what? Fuck that oh. hoe! Stain her zombak toe again. Oh, he not, he not moved on? Oh, so he a fuck nigga though. So. Because they don't deserve to be at the hands of a hoe, but the hands of a king. I thought Ichigo got that riz, but he lost his first girl to that bum Renji. Anyways, next guy I'm gonna be talking about is a little similar to Ichigo's situation, but he gets treated even worse. Zuko. Nah, bro. He's How? high key the best boy of the series. Yeah, not only did he lose his chance to smash guitar, not from anyone cool like Jet or Haru, but nah, he lost it to fucking Caillou of all people. Look at this bald ass kid having a wet dream and drooling <laughs> all over her. <laughs> Him trying to pull on Katara every time is the equivalent of Morty and Jessica. Zuko out here taking a fucking lightning bolt to his chest for her and you still want to get pecked by that goofy ass kid? What the fuck did this kid do to deserve Katara? Absolutely nothing, okay? What's with these bitches? Choosing the fucking ugly ass tattoo characters <laughs> over the goats. But at least he got his bad emo <laughs> GF May, right? Hey! Right? Oh, oh, wait, 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 hold on, man. You're going too fast, me, dog. Let but me at see. least he got his bad emo GF Hold May, on, let me right? see. Right? I know I keep screwing up, but please, I love you, May. I know, but lately I've been re realized that you love your secret. Okay, I don't know how to read. I don't know what, bro. Since I finished school, bro, I've been not knowing how to read or even speak. That you love your secrets more. You have an, an easier time keeping them when you're alone. What are you telling me? Goodbye. Oh. Wait, she don't know about this nigga past? Why the fuck this nigga not tell about her past? What the fuck? Oh, come on, bro. But Stop doing fast, man. Bad emo GF may right? Right? Hey, we gotta be pausing on here, man. Over here, whatever, yeah. Baby, Kilo, meet my new friend. Oh, my God. I lost my parents when I was young since I've been able to rebound. What the fuck? Been bounced from one place to another. I joined the society because I wanted to belong to something. I couldn't care less about all that political stuff. We're a top, boy. And then I'm... Mm, Meeting you made me realize that I don't want to belong to something anymore. I want to belong to someone and now You are right Zuko the mural keeps going. I'm impressed by another criminal lieutenant Talents, I don't know about yo this English man stick around. Maybe you'll find out Bro, is it gonna end man damn? Well, you're done talking about your ex-boyfriend I'll, I'll let me know so I can give you a kiss goodbye Whoa, 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 bro. I'm just with Tom Tom gone. I feel so empty inside. Thanks for everything, Kalo. Let's get some rest or they finna be fucking. <laughs> we'll figure out what's next in the morning. Another one. Release, release him, General Mark. As you wish. I think, bro, this is too long, bro. Okay, bad. He 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 got, he, bro. He got a bit took, man. Damn. That's rough, buddy. This is not fucking fair. In the comics, it's actually so bad. Aang over here literally has a groupie. Like, what the fuck? How does he have a groupie? He's a stop hating that boy. My probably got that schlong. Fucking goofy goober. And his main bitch Katara is all jealous and shit. Yeah, serves you right. Serves you right. That's what you get for dating a literal ugly bald ass kid. 
Sokka still somehow still has Suki, even though he has that ugly ass ponytail. And the worst part of all, this ugly, fat fucking pig <laughs> somehow managed to score a baddie. And it's not even just Zuko that's bad. Mako is just as bad too. Two of his ex-girlfriends are dating each other, and his little brother. Nah, bro, we have a rate, wrote, rate, oh goodness, I thought I said something else, man. Bro, whoever wrote this story, bro, now nah, you's a fuck nigga for that, bro. Why you gotta put that man through that? Bro, that boy literally got thrown away by his own father, burned by his own father, literally molested or abused, I don't know. Now two of his bitches, they dated him, and then now they dating each other, damn, bro. Nah, man, something gotta be wrong with the Zuko, man, or like, what the hell did he do to deserve this? He literally made them turn bisexual. Damn. Bolin, his bro. That's the worst. That's the worst way to go, bro. I don't know. I don't care, bro. That's the worst way to go. You date like you dating someone, and then after like you make them, you make like you the reason why they switch their like sexuality. That's crazy. Goofy ass brother somehow also has a baddie. I don't even like Mako. Oh, I was like, what the hell? But I'll admit, the guy has been done dirty. I'm 100% positive these writers hate attractive guy characters because they're always catching L's and the ugly ass characters <laughs> are catching W's. Aang may be the avatar, but that clearly didn't win the genetic lottery. Alright, let's take a look at his son, Boomy. What happens when you take the I out of his name? You get BOMB! Which is exactly what he is. And don't even get me started on the grandkids. And Katara, you know what Zuko is? He's bro, I don't know what the, that little nigga's deformed, bro. That is some incest tip. Don't Look at this ugly boy, man. I, I saw on like a, another recap, bro. Instantly, bro. I was locked in, feel me? Trying to see what the video is about to feel me. Doing a reaction, whatever. But, bro, the, like the first clip I saw this nigga hit, I was like... Who the fuck is this ugly ass little nigga, man? Like, bro, like, maybe after seeing that, bro, for a fuck a little, for like maybe one minute or two minutes, bro, I was not even focused on the video, bro. I was thinking about that, that nigga here. Like, why is it shaped like that? And Katara, you know what Zuko is? He is a fire lord. Bro, he's not this annoying ass kid that brings up his stupid air nomad shit every 10 seconds. That's the reason why you're stuck in that goddamn igloo. I know Zuko did some pretty bad shit to you before, but once again, he's an exception because of how gorgeous he is. But you took that Pause. Elder Kara with Aang, and you gotta live with that. And unfortunately, this show does have kiss scenes. Look at this shit. Katara looks like she's kissing a newborn baby. This shit looks nasty, bro. Man, she kissing her little brother, bro. Uh, my god, I can't even stand to look at it. But I'm done talking about Avatar, because recently, and I've been watching this high. other anime called Erased. And honestly, there is no way in hell this guy's gonna get cocked, alright? I mean, look how cute these two are together, and there is no way he's gonna get cocked. <sighs> Fool me once, shame- Bro, what happened to your mic, bro? He was sounding okay, now he just sound ass like mine. Baby. This shit looks nasty. Watching this other anime called Erased. <sighs> Fool me once, shame on you. <sighs> Fool me twice, shame on me. Fool me three times, shame on both of us. But fool me a fourth fucking time? Where's that bridge at? Cause I'm jumping. Nah, what the hell is going on? This is the most disrespectful thing you could do to a man. To make things worse, he didn't lose his girl to the cool-headed guy in the group, Kenya. Mm. Nah, he lost his girl to the dude with fucking androgyny. Someone who barely looks like a man. No, someone who doesn't look like a man at all. The fucking femboy stole your girl. Like, who are you? Who are you? You serve no purpose in this story <laughs> other than clapping her. That is the most embarrassing shit I've ever seen. Wait. He served her, but the, the whole story in, in terms of clapping her. What do you mean? Like, in terms of like... Like, my... 
Like he be fucking or what, bro? Hold on, what do you mean? You serve no purpose in this story other than clapping her. And he winning though. Am I, is there something, is the English not processing in my head? He's getting something. What the fuck is he talking about? That is the most embarrassing shit I've ever seen. Like, my guy, you have the exact same birthday as her. You are practically soulmates. I know there are people are going to be all like, it's realistic since he's in a coma and shit. Bruh, you go and tell me a man magically somehow has the ability to time travel. And worst of all, his serial killer was waiting for him for 15 years is realistic, but not his girl who couldn't keep her pussy in check? Besides, bitches nowadays have multiple ways of being happy, and the one thing she decided to choose was NTR? Nah, the girl knew what the fuck she was doing, okay? She cucked him on purpose. As a matter of fact, if this was ah, real- Bro, bro. That was not a good exp I think maybe because like he's not explaining what actually happened, that's why like I'm confused. He didn't like he should have like I think this party could have made it uh I'm not even I don't even make these type of videos. I have no room to even talk about like oh he could have made the video like this and that. I don't give a fuck man. I feel as if he could have explained what the fuck happened, because I don't know. Maybe he did explain, but I don't know. He just said he he was too he's like he doesn't serve no purpose. All he does is clap, I bet. Two minutes. He's saying he's getting NTR'd. Wait, he, he, and I don't know what do you mean he ended up in. How did he end up in a coma, man? Life narrative, it'll go with something like this. Hey, Hiromi, where's Kayo? I hope she's doing fine. Oh, yeah, she fine as hell for real. Well, like, how did he end up here? About? I didn't watch the anime, you see? Like, could have incorporated, like, trying to explain what the hell going on. Oh, you didn't hear? I'm fucking her. Huh? You heard, right? That girl you've been crushing on and saved her from her abusive mom? Yeah, I'm fucking her. What the fuck? You piece of shit. How could you? We were friends. Isn't it obvious? All those years of you calling me a femboy, saying I look like a girl, <laughs> but guess what? I showed her just how much of a man I am. You wouldn't believe it. That hoe was trying to fuck you while you were in a coma, but she just gonna get turned on because of how small your dick is. So I did what any guy would do. And goddamn, she was a freak. Do you want to know what she said while I was fucking her in the same room you were in? She said, I'm sorry, Satoru, but the wee wee too good. By the way, while I was giving her a facial, I may have accidentally shooted some of it inside your mouth. My back, huh? You <laughs> pay for this! Who gonna stop me? Huh? You cripple fuck? Don't even think about getting help from the other guys. They already have her only bad subscription. What do you want to sit huh? back, relax in that wheelchair, or better yet, that cock chair? What does he mean he, he come in his mouth? What the hell? See that guys that's already a better narrative than the whole story okay that's a very accurate narrative of what really happened what should have happened in the story okay that's basically what happened okay the man got cucked okay there, there's no change to that okay it doesn't matter if it's logical or not he got cucked simple as that Satoru your genes are average but that's still a hell lot better than femboy genes that baby is probably going to end up looking like James Charles anyway. Okay, okay, guys. I think I finally got the one. <laughs> the one goaded character that's 100% not going to get cucked. Guts oh. from Berserk. Bro, he's... Wait, is it... Nah, being cucked is when, like, the female... Uh, the... What is the actual meaning of it? Isn't when your shoddy is fucking another nigga... And you don't know. That's what it means. NTR. I don't know, bro. I'm not really tapped in on those type of things. But if the female was forcefully, you feel me, yeah. Forcefully, yeah. If you know the story, if you don't know, I, that's how I, I, this guy should ex explain this. It's goofball, you feel me? 
another goofball say, yo, bro, join my gang. And then this guy said, nah, bro, I'm good. Like, he, like they were friends or something like that. He just said, nah, bro, I'm good. I don't want to go join your gang. But, hey, I appreciate the offer. The goofball say, oh, this guy doesn't want to join my gang. You know what? I'm going to fuck up his life. This man, at some, I don't know when, along, somewhere along the lines, this man, uh, for me, R-A-P-E, his shoddy in front of him. Just because this goofball didn't want to join his gang, he didn't even he didn't even deny it in the most disrespectful way. He just said, nah, bro, I'm good, bro. I want to do things on my own. Already clapping that girl. <sighs> As a matter of fact, take a look at this monologue. He found his wife, the love of his life. You see, life was starting to make sense. He had a big, nice wedding. Everything was just so immaculate. He finally found purpose. His heart was pounding as she walked down the aisle. She was the one for him. She was chosen. They have a beautiful daughter together. Everything was going so oh, great. Then you got daughter? Beautiful pictures. Beautiful views. How can anything be so beautiful? I don't know that. What could possibly go wrong? Bro, why, bro, why did this, bro, 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 this group, bro, I'm not finna get a, a, another community strike because of another person's video, not mine. I'm literally right into another video, another person's video that is on YouTube. No, it can't be. No, no. Next cock we got is. <sighs> bro, I wish you yeah, I, I hope you feel me. You know what berserk is. You already watched it. Because, bro. Watching it on the recap or like is not isn't is, for me. You're not fully experiencing the fucked up the fucked upness of the of the of the enemy. I hope y'all watch the enemy, bro. Before like for me, this is not like a spoiler, cause yo, 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 yo. Sadly, guts. Nah, nah. This ain't right, bro. What is going on? Remember how he said the femboy from Erased wanted ah. revenge porn against the MC? Like, this is like 100 times worse, bro. This femboy Griffith was so pity about Guts. He sacrificed all his comrades in the Eclipse and then fucked his girl right in front of him, bro. That is a whole nother level of cuckery. To make things worse, this man Griffith converted himself from having a BWC to a BBC to give her that black <laughs> treatment, bro. Do you know what's worse? She still wants the, the BBC. BBC. And spoilers ahead, we see her getting taken away like she's fucking Princess Tiana, bro. Instead of getting fucked by a- No, she got manipulated. What the hell are you talking about? I think it's- Wait, bro. Bro, from- You see, this goofball doesn't know how to explain, like, uh, what actually happens in the anime. He's just, just saying whatever, bro. Uh, I wish I can do that too, but hey, I hate editing, bro. I hate editing, man. Someone edit for me, man. We can split the money when we when we make money from the video, like 50-50. Shit, I say some stupid shit. We get the views, we make money. You edit the whole video, so all right, that's it. Bro, I think after like then it's either like the goofball traumatized her and then made her like Nah, bro, like, I think the goofball put something in her, like, like he, he manipulated her. That's why she, she went with that nigga. What the fuck? Hawk, she's getting fucked by a hawk. Bro, that is criminal. Guts is out here crying. Hey, hey it happened, it happened. Well, at least it can't get any worse. No, no, no. <laughs> ah, bro, I can't see nothing, bro. This is, like, high quality here, man. What the hell? Hey, you are okay, Peter. Oh, this is this is a this is a Spider-Man, and we already know about Spider-Man, so there's no there's no need for me to read this. It's too long. <laughs> we ain't reading nah, on nah, that, bro. My boy Frail needs a new fucking writer. He's out here risking his life to save Mary Jane from another dimension, just for her to be getting clapped by this ugly, 
ass self insert named Paul. And it's not even just the comic version that's trash. trash. All Mary Janes are thoughts. Even <laughs> Zendaya, her being a whore is literally a canon event. Even the spectacular Spider Man version was terrible. I mean, she's the most bad of all, but she was going out with like four different dudes. Now that's just. Worst part is, Gwen's not safe either. There's <sighs> just one comic where she gets clapped by the freaking Green Goblin, fucks her, and her kids end up beating the shit out of Spider Man. Whoa, 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 whoa. What, what do you. What, what do you mean, her, her kid? Yeah. Nah, bro. Her kids end up beating the shit by the freaking Green Goblin, fucks her. And her kids end up beating the shit out of Spider-Man. Nah, bro. This is not right. My man Guts may have suffered a lot, but at least the writers love and respect him. The writers for Spider-Man, on the other hand, just use him to vent out their frustration whenever they get rejected by a girl. Yo, fuck these shitty ass writers. <coughs> In conclusion, every dude here got played dirty. People be saying that Ken Kaneki and Subaru suffered the most, but at least those guys got their main girls. But nah, not them. I hope this is a male and female, man. These guys didn't just. There's nothing wrong with. There's nothing wrong with a male, male, female, and female. Risk their lives, their limbs to save them. <sighs> they had chemistry, dynamic, emotions, a whole episode, arcs, and a series dedicated to these two. And most importantly, they're. <laughs> Hold on. Episode, arcs, and a series dedicated. This Spider-Man, this bitch literally jumped out the, the window. Just to see how much this nick this nigga Peter loves her, loves her. Like bro, come on man. It cannot be that it cannot be that good to the point where you gotta be sacrificing yourself and like the bit that you the bit that even the bitch that even fuck with you like that. What did it to these two? And most importantly they're hard as fuck. Satoru, you average though. Ah! It should have been me, not him. And yet these. Bro, bro, what the fuck is what? This nigga weird. This gotta be the old video. Yeah, oh, it, it is an old video, cause bro, I don't know how this allowed on YouTube. Pose all got clapped by clowns. Ah! It should have been me. Nah, it can't be, bro. These hoes ain't loyal. Ichigo, you lost your main B to fucking Renji of all people. Both you and Naruto had to resort to the side B. Bro, you're saying the side B like the, the, the side bitches were trash. Nigga, both of them literally... Nigga, both Hinata and that that girl from one... from I don't know, bro. I don't remember her. She's like her. Not very memorable. Bro, both of them got... You feel me? They got me, man. Like I be saying, I need me on my bone. What the fuck is you talking about? And they're much more attractive than 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 the main bitches. Bro, what? Aaron and Zuko, not only did you lose your main B to two ugly asses, you lost your side B to fucking background characters. Like, bro, is that <laughs> really the price for your honor and freedom? No pussy. Aaron, I know you died and shit, but you couldn't be like David, who at least got to hit his shorty before he got packed up. Uh, I don't know how you expect Aaron to to hit because the bitch literally told her uh she uh the nigga's family, so I don't know how you expected him to hit. Satoru and guts, you lost your girls to the fanboys. Satoru, I. I'm gonna see you in the next video for this nigga pissing me off, bro. Call me Mr. Zen, cause I'm a flippy bass.